Hi, I'm Magnus Polman. I'm a pediatric neurologist working mainly with children with cerebral palsy in Gothenburg, Sweden. I'm happy to present a manuscript, Autism and ADHD in Children with Cerebral Palsy, High Prevalence Rates in a Population-Based Study, which is published online open access in developmental medicine and child neurology. This project aimed to establish accurate prevalence rates of autism and ADHD in children with cerebral palsy. Our hypothesis was that both autism and ADHD are underdiagnosed in these children. Given that early identification of impairments is important for adequate understanding and support, it would be essential to estimate uh, the rate of autism and ADHD in children with cerebral palsy. The CP Register of Western Sweden is a long-running register going back to the 1950s with high quality and ascertainment. The register is a solid base for this population-based research. Combined with the leading expertise on neuropsychiatric impairments at Gilbert Neuropsychiatry Centre provided an excellent opportunity for this project. The original population comprised 264 children, eight birth year cohorts, who are studied at school age. The project can be described as a three-stage rocket with a systematic and active study approach. Autism is here colored blue and ADHD red. First, a retrospective record-based study of already identified impairments showed that autism had been diagnosed in 18% and ADHD in 21% of the children. Then, the children were screened through comprehensive parent-completed questionnaires. The screening was positive to a much higher extent. Autism was suspected in 35% and ADHD in 50% of the children. In the present study, we assessed the children where screening results and diagnosis were not fully concordant. These children participated in neuropsychiatric examinations by an experienced multidisciplinary team. New diagnoses were carefully made with special consideration to intellectual level and other impairments. Established diagnostic instruments worked well for all but the most disabled group of children. In total, 200 of the 264 children completed the screening and assessment in the project. 59 of the 200 children had autism, while 60 of the children had ADHD. Since 29 children had both diagnoses, autism and or ADHD was present in 90 children, that is in 45%. In other words, 15% had autism only, 15% had ADHD only, and 15% had both diagnoses. In addition, some children had obvious signs of autism and ADHD, but did not fully meet diagnostic criteria. Autism and ADHD prevalence rates were not associated with degree of gross motor function impairment, in contrast to other known associated impairments in children with cerebral palsy. Both autism and ADHD were strongly associated with degree of intellectual disability. In fact, multiple regression analysis revealed that both autism and ADHD were predicted mainly by intellectual disability and by each other. Intellectual disability was present in 50% of the children, autism in 30% and ADHD in 30% and often coexisting. Altogether, two-thirds of the 200 children had one, two or all three of these impairments. You can see the associations illustrated proportionally to area in this Euler diagram. In conclusion, autism and ADHD were very common in children with cerebral palsy in this population-based study, more common than earlier reported and in the same range as intellectual disability and epilepsy. Autism and ADHD were predicted mainly by intellectual disability, but not associated with gross motor function level. Due to the high prevalence rates, assessment for autism and ADHD is warranted as part of the evaluation of children with cerebral palsy. 
we suggest an approach similar to the present studies with screening and if indicated further assessment before school start age. Of course earlier assessment is eligible if there are clear signs of autism and ADHD. The children will benefit from early diagnosis and adapted support for all their impairments, hopefully leading to a better function and participation in life. Thank you.